Texas A&M, this goes out to y'all fans. Don't y'all think for one minute, because y'all beat Sam Houston State, that y'all can hang with the elite teams in the SEC. Because from what I've seen today, y'all going to be bottom of the barrel in, in the SEC once a damn again. And you're going to continue to be that damn 8-4 and four team that you always been. I done told you time and time again, when it comes to Jimbo Fisher, he's overhyped, overrated, and overpaid, and he's robbing Texas A&M out of their damn money. The only thing to keep damn uh, Jimbo Fisher relevant is his fucking mouth. He talk good. That's it. I don't give a damn. I don't give a damn about y'all scoring 31 points today. It's Sam Houston State. Matter of fact, halftime, you damn supposed to be star running back. Only had eight yards rushing. He, and he had 49 yards rushing. And that's against Sam Houston State. Y'all wind up with 110 yards rushing against Sam Houston State. That is a damn shame. Y'all should have at least, shit, 180 to 200 yard rushing against Sam Houston State. Notice how I keep fucking emphasizing Sam Houston State just so y'all can know exactly who y'all played. That was damn re fucking ridiculous. Okay? You might say, oh, oh, we got an elite defense. Fuck no, you don't. You played Sam Houston State. Okay? That, that I mean, damn, man. Damn. You you can't muster but 17 fucking points in the first half against Sam Houston State. Okay? You can only muster 25 yards rushing in the first half against Sam Houston State. And your damn quarterback had 17 of them. <laughs> this is what y'all been talking about all, all fucking season. I mean, y'all y'all paid out all that money for these results. Come on, man. Y'all got to do a whole lot damn better. This is a damn shame. I mean, Jesus. Let's look. You fucking you fucking running back had 42 yards rushing. Your quarterback had 35. So what is that? That's 77 yards of 110 yards by your damn uh uh your, your running back and your in your damn quarterback and your quarterback had damn damn near as many as your damn running back. That don't make no sense against Sam Houston State. It don't matter. And then Haynes King got there throwing fucking interceptions. How the hell are you throwing interceptions against Sam Houston State and you think you're going to be <laughs> be able to compete in the SEC, especially with these high-level teams? Hell no, Texas A&M. Hell no. Shit, from the way y'all look today, Miami going to get y'all to run for y'all goddamn money. And you just might lose. So if you lose to Miami... Don't come with all these goddamn excuses. Take your fucking loss and roll on with it. And, and just admit that y'all overpaying damn Jimbo Fisher and he robbing the shit out of y'all. That's all you got to do. From what I was told, our damn offensive line got holes, secondary got holes, and all that shit. Running backs unproven, wide receiver unproven. Shit looked like to me Everything about Texas A&M got holes and unproven. Performing like this against fucking Sam Houston State. Come on, Texas A&M fans, y'all got to do y'all got to do better than this, man. Call it for what it is. That's all I'm saying. Call it for what it is. You ain't nowhere going by this game. Now, granted, it's the first game, but I don't give a damn because y'all got. A whole lot more talent than damn Sam Houston State. You got a whole lot better players. You supposedly got a better coach, but I can't fucking tell. Like I said, I don't give a damn that uh, y'all won 31 nothing. You still look like ass. That's all I can say. Like I said, you should have had 35 to 42 points going into the half, but yet you got 17. And you only could muster up 14 in the fucking second half against Sam Houston State. But I ain't going to be too hard on you, Texas A&M, because I already know you ain't going to be shit this year. 
y'all Texas A&M fans just got to come to grips that y'all ain't going to be shit. That's all I'm saying. I ain't saying you ain't never going to be shit. I'm just saying you ain't going to be shit this year. And I can guarantee you that. And you might win eight games going by what I've seen today. You just might win eight games. I don't know, man. I damn sure don't know. Now, from what I've seen today, I don't doubt that Miami can beat y'all. I don't doubt it. I had y'all picked to beat Miami, but from what I've seen today, Miami got a damn good chance of whooping y'all ass, and they just might do it. And if they do, you can trust and believe. I will be here once again to let y'all know that y'all are the bottom of the barrel, and y'all ain't going to do a damn thing, and you definitely ain't going to the SEC championship. And for, uh, what, what's his name to pick y'all to, to my, y'all going to the playoffs and going to win the damn, uh, uh, national championship. He pick you to win the SEC championship, go to playoff and win the national championship. There's my how. I bet he looking like a damn fool now. I can guarantee it. Right, Cause y'all made him look that way today. So Texas A&M, don't shoot the message. I'm just being real with you and telling you the damn truth. Y'all bottom of the damn barrel, roll damn tide.